So now, on, in this video, on the right, we still have the stock firmware. On the left, now that one has been updated to firmware 2.34. So if you remember in this last video, if you saw it, if you didn't, go back and check it out. We were working off of 2.32, this is 2.34. So we're gonna do the same songs and 60%. These are both on EQ1. I checked on EQ2 with these, it still makes them brighter. So if you were looking for bass, that ain't gonna work using EQ2, even after these updates. So 60%, we're gonna start at on that same track that we did before, and we'll see what we got. That is the firmware update of 2.34. So, to me, that's not as big a difference as the 2.32 compared to the stock as this 2.34 doesn't seem like as big of a difference as 2.32 was. Let's change track and go back to the flow song and see if that sounds any different. Because as that is, it doesn't seem, it doesn't jump out at me as being as different as the other one. All right, here we go. Okay, so now I'm going to pause this and I'm going to go take that stock firmware and put it to the 2.32 and then we'll have the 2.34 on the left and we'll see what the two firmware updates sound like against each other. So the magic of video, I'll be right back. Okay, so now we have on the left the 2.34 firmware, on the right the 2.32 firmware. So both of these have been updated. So I personally, I think the 2.32 still sounds better, but we're going to do a little demo with a different song. Here we go. This is 60%. I may raise it up a little bit. That's 2.34. Bump the 
volume up a little bit. 2.32 which is the one on the right is the better firmware update it does more to the low end as far as making the making it sound like it's got a fuller deeper sound the firmware 2.34 doesn't change things as much and I think the 2.32 sounds just a little bit louder actually also so I will leave a link for the 2.34 and I'll go ahead and leave the 2.32 in there also, which I left that on the last video. So you guys can do what you want with that as far as picking which one. You know, if you want to listen to each one yourself, everybody's got their own set of ears. But for me, the 2.32 is the one that I'm going to be using. And I'll go ahead and I'm going to bump that one on the left to the 2.32 also. And I think it overall is a good improvement to the speaker. The speaker wasn't bad. It was getting a bad rap. But this definitely improves it. So if you're on the fence about getting one, thinking, oh, I've heard a lot of bad stuff. The bass is not very good. If you update it, I think you'll be happy with it. I'll probably run this against the Tribit Blast now that it's been updated. Just see how that hangs with that. Tribit Blast, it, has, it does have a good full bass sound to it. But this definitely changes things because a lot of people, like I said, were complaining. I think a lot of people will be more happy with this. And those of you that sent yours back already, you may have prematurely jumped the gun. But let me know what you guys think in the description below. And like I said, I'll post those links for you guys. Have a good Sunday evening. That's a wrap.